Yesterday we got back from our week-long family vacation. Even though the twins had a very hard time adjusting and we didn't get a full night's rest the whole entire time that we were there, we had tons of help from family. So I think the overall trip was a success. I was so worried that we were gonna come home and the twins would not adjust well at home and we'd have to like reintroduce them to home life again. But we got home and they missed their beds so much and they were just as equally exhausted as we are. And they slept last night from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. So that was a great success. I had very high hopes that I was gonna be productive today but we were just absolutely freaking exhausted and I need to get my shit together. We all just woke up from two hour naps. My husband just washed all the cars. So let's be productive, right little bean? Worst part about going on a trip and coming back is unpacking all your shit. Like this is the worst thing. This will literally sit here for a month. I'll just do my laundry and the rest of it will sit here for a month. While we were on vacation, I did get to go to the outlets only because my favorite Tory Burch sandals, the strap broke right off and I am so pissed about it and they don't make them anymore. So I couldn't get new ones, but I did go to Aerie and I got this sweatshirt, this shirt, and a really comfy bra because I wear the same bra almost every single day because I don't know anything else that's comfortable. In our neighborhood, we have a really, really tight friend group. And at this point, they're not even friends. They're family. We do basically everything together. We share everything together. And while we were on vacation, one of our really good friends and neighbors welcomed their first baby. And I'm going to make them dinner tonight, bring it over, and meet baby Summer. And I cannot freaking wait. She's going to be eight months apart from my kids. And I just can't wait for our babies to grow up together. Like, this is what dreams are made of, I guess. I always joke that none of us are allowed to move. And if we do decide to move, we need to find a neighborhood that all four couples can move to. That way, our families can and grow up together. I did it! Look how pretty that girl is! Ew. What a pretty girl! <gasps> We don't have any food in the house because we just got back from vacation. We have our own grocery shopping, but we do have this is my husband's famous frozen spaghetti sauce. So I unfroze it. I'm gonna make him some noodles and I'm gonna send it over. They're gonna come after me about giving them frozen food. The sauce tastes a hundred times better once it's been frozen. I don't know what it is, but I don't make the rules. It just tastes. And I know after I gave birth, the only thing that I wanted people to bring to my house was food because we ate off of leftovers for I feel like months. I'm coming.